Jay Nasty? Oh, crap! Crap! You guys know who Jay Nasty is? Not Jay Nasty. Oh, you split streamer, but that's not Jay Nasty. You're gonna lose. Capture the. Hey guys, Jay Nasty here. What is up, guys? Um, if you guys didn't know, today is my birthday, so this video is scheduled. I probably won't read your comments. Uh, I probably won't be home till later tonight. But anyways, guys, what I want to say is um, thanks for all the support on my channel lately. Uh, it's been doing good. I've been enjoying making the videos. Um, sorry, I haven't been uploading like a lot of a lot of gameplays or been trying for a lot of gameplays. I just haven't been playing a lot. Um, I usually play league play, and I don't know if you guys would just want to watch straight league play. So I'll try to go for some 200 pluses in Black Ops 2. And try to go for some more Moabs and Modern Warfare 3. My sleep schedule, if I, if you guys didn't know, is extremely fucked up. I woke up at 2 this morning. 2 this morning. It's 3.30 in the morning. I'm not really tired. And uh, I slept for like 8 hours. But um, anyways, guys, this gameplay is actually versus some subscribers, which I thought was pretty fun. Uh, it was they, Every time I killed them, they would say, I love you, Jay Nasty. One, that one guy at the very beginning did. And then the other guys were just... It was just it was just a really fun game playing against some, uh, some subscribers. Um... I was a little bit mean to him, and I spawn trapped him with sentry guns and stuff like that on CTF slums. But uh, I just, I just thought it was a real fun game, and really, uh, you know, it was a really fun game, like I said. But anyways, what I want to talk to you guys about is this story. Like this happened the other day, and um, I think it happened. Yeah, it happened like two days ago on the 23rd on Wednesday. I think no Wednesday, so that was the 24th. But what happened was uh, I walked outside. Me and my friend we were planning on going fishing at this one lake called Lake Calaveras, right? You fish for red, uh, freshwater redfish and catfish. So we walked out. It was like 10, 10 at night. I walked out, and I saw the moon. And I was like, wow, it's extremely bright out here. Let's go fishing right now. Let's go tonight. And um, my friend's like, all right, let's go. So <clears throat> my friend called one of his friends, and he said, let's go. So we left my house at 1030, got my kayak, got my fishing poles. Um, we got out. We got out around to Lake uh, actually, we we're gonna go to Lake Brawning, right? We we're gonna go to Lake Brawning, and now I remember, uh, not Lake Calaveras. We were, we eventually went it, ended up going to Lake Calaveras, but we were just like, all right, let's go to Lake Brawning, and um, so we dra we got everything ready. It's about twelve thirty. We we get to the we get to Lake Brawning, and the only way to get into Lake Brawning is by a state park, right? So we pull up there, and it says closes at ten, opens at six, and so it's like it's like twelve o'clock right now. We're like, fuck. Do you guys want to wait six hours, or do you want to try doing something else? So. My friend has Google Maps on his phone, and we're looking at roads which which could get us near the uh, the lake, right? Where we could put our kayak in, set our lines, and just fish off the bank. And uh, so we're driving down all these roads, all these roads, and every one of them, we would get to a road and we'd be blocked off, right? And on the Google Maps, it'd show a dirt road that goes right, like right next to the lake that you could easily drop in. But it was all blocked off, and the reason why this is all blocked off because there's a power plant on the, on this lake. Um, so it's really, really tough. There's only one spot to get into this lake um, through that public park. So we're like, fuck it. You know what? Um, let's just go to back to this one spot where the road was closed. Let's, let's jump out. Let's walk down there, see how close we can go. We'll just grab the kayak later. We'll scout it out, grab the kayak, and uh, just fish off the bank and fish from right there. So we go down this, okay, we go down this long-ass fucking road. And remember, it's like 12 at night, 12, 1 o'clock at night, in the middle of fucking nowhere, right? Middle, middle of nowhere. So... We, we park our car down at this barricade, right? It says uh, road closed. So we're, we park there. I turn right. There's this little opening in the woods. And I turn right and I park my car to the right. Where So if you're looking at the road, there's this little hole in it. And I went through the hole. Then I turn right. So nobody could see me from the street, right? So we jump this barbed wire fence. And we're walking We're walking down this randomly this random dirt road. And I'll show you a little picture of how fucking sketchy it was. Uh, picture should be on your screen now. Um... I gotta remember what time, four minutes. Okay, four minutes on the video. That's where I need to put it on. But um, we, we go and we're just walking, we're just walking down this road, right? Just walking down this road. And we come to this little light in the middle of nowhere, just sitting there with a, with a gated fence. And we're like, oh, that's pretty sketchy. What the fuck? And this was like the sketchiest shit I've ever done. You never trespass in Texas. Like that, that was probably the stupidest thing I've ever done is trespassing in, in, on, in Texas at like, 12 to 1 in the morning so we keep walking we come up to this huge huge fence uh, bob wired all over the place and we're like fuck man what are we going to do the gate's locked so there's just another random ass road that goes to the right so we're like all right let's just go down this random road um, and see what happens so we, we start walking down this random road and we look to our left and we saw that the fence there was really no fence right there there's no bob wire fence or anything so we start walking down 
start walking down in this long, long, like three foot grass. I turn around, I see a light, and I'm thinking it's that light that we passed earlier, right? The light in the middle of nowhere with that gated fence. And uh, I said, look at that light. Um, and my friend, my friend turns around and he starts looking at it and I just turned around, I didn't think nothing of it. And the light was moving. We're like, what in the fuck is going on? So this light is moving, right? So a car, I don't even, like, I don't understand how this car got on this road, right? This car, I don't know if it came from that fucking random light with that little gate. I have no clue where this car came from. So it's just driving about 10 miles an hour down this fucking road, right? And we're just standing in the bushes and we just, we're just fucking crouching. We're like, oh my God. I remember my friend. My, he's one of my good friends. He comes over all the time. Jacob, you guys probably see him in my live stream. He was flipping out. He was really flipping the fuck out. Um, we, were, we were all kind of flipping out. But these guys were – he was like the most scared out of anybody. I thought it was kind of funny though. But So this car comes comes down and he's driving down the road and we're just sitting in the bush. And we're like, fuck, fuck. And remember, he, go, he pulls up to that big-ass gate, right? He just pulls up to that big-ass gate. And we're about – we're probably about 50 feet away just sitting in the brush. And we're just looking at him like, what the fuck is he going to do? And he parks the fucking car. And I'm like, guys, we got we to gotta go now. Because they wanted to just wait there. They just want to sit in that long brush and wait there. And I'm like, guys, we need to fucking go right now. Um, in, in, my, in the back of my mind, I was like, we're going to get fucking shot. We're going to we're gonna get shot and die out here. Nobody's ever going to find our fucking bodies. Like, that's what I was thinking about. I was like, we're going to get fucking shot out here. So... What we did is we just took off, ran into the woods in the middle of the night, just ran into the middle of the woods. And this, but right before, like right before we uh, went in the woods, the car turns around and starts uh, and just sits there. He's just sitting there, and he, but he turned around, right? And we need to go the way the, the way the car is facing. That's the way we need to go back. That's the road we came from to get to my truck, right? So we just haul ass through the fucking woods, man. Just haul ass through the fucking woods, and we get out of the woods. We're, like this is some thick ass shit. We were, I remember running through some sunflower, like a sunflower bushes or whatever the fuck you want to call them, and they were about six feet fucking high. And I was doing high knees through that bitch. I was just doing high knees, and for some reason, all like the, my two friends that were with me, they got their arms were all fucking cut up and shit, and I didn't get cut at all. I, I guess it's because I'm I'm just a man and shit. But we get through there. We're just sitting. We're just sitting in the fucking bush, right? We're just sitting in the bush and we're just waiting right here. We can see my truck. There's about 100, 100 feet to my truck and it's a little open field and there's a gate that we have to jump um, in order to get to my truck so I can get in it, turn around, go down the, and haul ass and get the fuck out of there. So we're just sitting there and all of a sudden we see a light way far off to the left it, and it looks like a light. My friend said he saw a light, but I think it was just the road because um, there's a big field, right? And you can see the, you can see the car, uh, car lights from the road. So we're just sitting here. We're just waiting. We're like, where the fuck is this dude at? And all of a sudden we just we're like fuck it let's go and we take off we're running in my truck and I remember there's this there's a bob wire fence with a gate right and so if you have a brain you're gonna jump you're gonna try to jump the gate because there's no bob wire on it my friend tries to jump the bob wire fence fails and then he goes he goes over the gate and I tried to just squeeze through the gate and I remember I go through there and my balls got stuck on the bar man and I pinched my nuts so bad I couldn't I couldn't go through because my balls were just swinging on my knee. And, and swinging on the bar, so I had to back out and just hopped over the very top of it. But we eventually get out of my truck and we get the fuck out of there. And um, we're like, you know what, fuck, dude, that was that was so sketchy. So what we did later that night is we actually went to Lake Calaveras, parked in this random ass neighborhood, jumped another fence, walked about a hundred feet, and started fishing at Lake Calaveras. Um, we trespassed at that that place as well, just because we were out there. It's about three. It's probably about two in the morning at this time, and we're just fishing. And I missed the biggest fucking fish of my life. I missed, like, Lake Calaveras has some huge redfish and huge catfish. And uh, I, I missed the biggest fish of my life that night. Um, I was pretty upset. And we only caught one fish. We fished from, like, 2 in the morning to fucking 9, I think 9 in the morning. We, we caught one fish. I was pretty upset. Um, but, yeah, it was, cra it was crazy. I, I honestly, in the back of my mind, I thought we were going to get shot. I thought we were going to get killed. So this was my thought process when we were walking through those trees and shit. I was gonna stay in the middle, um, just because if the guy in the front got shot, it wouldn't have been me. If the guy in the back got shot, it wouldn't have been me. And I know that's a, that's a shitty thing to think when you're out there, but that was my thought process. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, hope you enjoy this commentary. It's really, really long, and I hope you enjoy the life stories. What I'm gonna try to do later on my uh, on my channel is I'm actually going to um, I'm actually gonna try to do some more face cam commentaries and just not even talk over gameplay, but just talk about some events. 
or some viral videos and shit like that. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that, and hopefully you guys enjoy the commentary. Um, like I said, I was scared shitless. I think my my friend fucked up his knee as well. Like his knee was all swollen after that, and we're we're fucking. I was bear grizzle. I was bear. Gri I was about to say bear grizzle, but we were bear gri uh, grills out there, dude. It was fucking insane, man. It, it was so fucking sketchy. Never again. Never again. But. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay. If we can hit 3,000 likes, if you're still with me, that'd be great. Uh, peace out. Slip bag. Motherfuckers. Swipe. Swipe. Penis pump. In my butt. I don't know. I I'm just I'm just so tired. I can't do the outro properly.